I'm going to show you how you can access Adobe Photoshop's super resolution feature and show you that you are probably going to start using it on most of the images that you work with. It is incredibly easy to use, it just takes a single click and the way it works is this. The first thing we need to do is go to edit all the way down to preferences and then to camera raw. Then we want to go to file handling here and this is the key. Under JPEG, we want to change it from Disable JPEG Support to Automatically all Open All Supported JPEGs. Then click OK, and then we can go ahead and open up a file. So we'll open up a couple of them here just to test things out. So here's our first JPEG. And what happens is, now that we have made that setting adjustment, it's going to open the JPEG up in the Camera Raw filter to begin with. And super resolution is as easy to use as this. You're going to right click on the image, go all the way down to enhance, and it's going to quickly process. So let's see what super resolution does. Well, first of all, what it does do is doubles the resolution of the image, which is actually going to quadruple the pixel count. So if the image started at a, th a thousand by a thousand pixels, it's going to be brought up to 4,000 by 4,000. Now, besides the fact that it increases the resolution, it also sharpens up details as well. So you can see here the difference in the makeup and in the eye, AI image, so the eye is not perfectly formed there. Also details up here, just incredible. So we'll go ahead and enhance that. You can see here that it processes on the device and takes us up to 16-bit 1280 by 1664, which is 2.1 megapixels and that is at 300 dpi. Now, while we're in here, we can also make lots of other adjustments before we start editing our photo. For example, we can click the magic button here, auto, and see the vibrance and exposure just come to light for us. But let's go ahead and try this with another image. So I see the one that I want to work with, but just to make sure that I have the right version here, let's open up our moon. This is an AI generated moon, so it's going to look a little bit funky. But once again, we're just going to right click, enhance, and we can see it on this image how it really improves the clarity, adds to detail, just incredible. So let's go ahead and enhance this. We'll watch it process on our device and change from 0.6 megapixels up to 2.4 megapixels at 300 dpi. Just incredible. Once again, while we're here, I would probably click the auto button just for sport. And let's try it with one more image. Let's go here and open up something like this right here. Open up. It'll open up in Camera Raw. Once again, it is simple as right click, enhance, and we can see what it's doing here with the detail on this image. Excellent. So we'll enhance that. We will hit our auto button. And this time, let's open it up and zoom in so we can have a look at the detail of this newly upscaled image. I think that that is incredible. Really nice looking image as well. It's quite captivating. So there you go. It is that easy to access super resolution, double the resolution of your images, quadruple your pixel count so that you have much clearer, sharper images to work with. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, then like it and definitely subscribe to encourage me to make more videos for you. And with that, I'll catch you on the next one.